Welcome to 21st Century Oncology, setting the industry standard in state-of-the-art IMRT treatment. Hello. We hope that this video will provide some valuable information regarding your IMRT treatment at 21st Century Oncology. IMRT stands for Intensity Modulated Radiation Therapy. We want you to understand the significant advantages provided by this state-of-the-art technology and the steps that are necessary to ensure its optimal delivery. Our planning and quality assurance process provides the best treatment results possible while assuring minimal adverse side effects. Please make notes of any questions you would like to discuss with your team of treatment professionals. The most important aspect of IMRT is the imaging and planning that takes place between the time we decide on this treatment and the actual delivery of the first treatment. Simple treatment in the past was quickly planned and started. More sophisticated treatment requires more time, effort, and planning to create a more desirable outcome. Let's compare the two. In the past, radiation therapy planning would be done with a simple x-ray machine. We had x-ray equipment, did a very good job of showing us bony anatomy, but did not do a good job of showing us the anatomy represented by the rectum, uh, the bladder, or the prostate. If we wanted to see the rectum, we would have to put a tube into the rectum, put contrast into the rectum so we could see the rectum on a film. If we wanted to shape the radiation beam, we would create a lead cutout of uh, the area we wanted the radiation to hit and the area we wanted blocked. This would go into the head of the linear accelerator or radiation machine and the radiation would pass through hitting what we wanted to and blocking what we didn't want to hit. We would put four fields on with the prostate uh, approximately in the middle of the field and we would treat the prostate with radiation. We can now look at how intensity modulated radiation therapy planning and new methods of imaging the pelvis with CAT scan and MRI scan have brought us into a new era. Hi, I'm Mark Lee, medical physicist with 21st Century Oncology. As you can hear and see, this is a CAT scan unit. It is used as an imaging modality along with MRIs for IMRT planning. Once CT and MRI images have been obtained, your physician uses computers to fuse the two modalities. We can then create cross-sections of the patient's anatomy from top to bottom, side to side, and front to back. We can also move from CT to MRI or combinations to best define the patient's anatomy. Here we see the hip bones in gray, the bladder in yellow, the rectum in purple, and our target, the prostate, in red. The computer is then instructed to target the prostate and avoid the hips, bladder, and rectum. This plan shows the red or high dose of radiation overlying the prostate precisely, an excellent avoidance of the bladder, rectum, and hips. Once this plan has been generated, our physics staff will perform quality assurance checks to confirm before treatment that the plan is precise and perfected. The transition from static radiation therapy to intensity modulated radiation therapy requires precise computer driven multi leaf collimators. The multi leaf collimators consist of 120 small lead leaves which can move in and out of the radiation therapy field while the radiation is being delivered to the treatment area. Such an effect allows us to block the areas which need to be blocked like bladder and rectum and deliver radiation to the area that needs to be radiated like the prostate in a much more precise fashion than we've ever been able to accomplish before. This allows us much more than we ever could before to block critical structures like bladder and rectum thereby reducing the side effects of radiation caused by radiation to those critical structures like injury to bladder and rectum, yet keep the prostate 
within the radiation therapy field throughout, uh, we can deliver higher doses with fewer side effects. Modern IMRT treatment is precise. The patient needs to be immobilized for planning images and for each treatment. For this purpose, a pillow-like structure is custom designed to fit the patient's lower body and is fashioned as shown here in this demonstration. This becomes the patient's own personal cradle for the duration of treatment. Now we are ready for IMRT treatment to begin. Complicated treatment has required all the precision and planning just depicted. But from a patient's standpoint, treatment is actually quick and simple. The therapist helps the patient onto the treatment table, setup is confirmed, the machine performs the necessary and precise treatment, the patient typically leaves the office five minutes later, still able to make their tea time. Your physician and treatment team hope that this video has provided a basic understanding of the IMRT process. Your comfort and confidence is very important to us. Please feel free to watch this video again and refer any questions to your team of treatment professionals. Thank you.